we cannot run away from that. As we cannot control who we are. I remember you are a woman and that will remain like that. The sooner we understand and get that to play, the better. Because once as a woman, you assume the role of being a man in the family, you will not be able to change that of your kids' minds. That they will not see you as a man. They will see you as Baba Bolo Apresi. When our, all we are trying to do is controlling a situation that needed the presence of a father. He wouldn't have said anything. Because I was to say anything. I in a family or in a home without a father, for whatever reason, you find that the father who understands that they are masculine, that the owner of that home. They can take advantage of you anytime. And you know that. You live with the fear of that. And that will happen because man has lost their position. And man has values. That as a man you don't do this to a woman. As a man you don't do this in general, away Moral contact. He will know that. He will not go around stealing people's property and possessing it as he is to have all. And then even our politicians are no longer leaders. They are behind power. And you may find that now go way back then or wherever they are, they go to position and then twisted and traded their moral values for power. Which is now affecting the whole nation. And the law was the Taupa Mabosi Benetai, a brief day, Bantana Labadao Pula, without the father being. But you and I have got the opportunity to come to this place today and remind each other of who the father really is. As I'm saying, as men we can know but outgrow being fathers. I'm very sad about we here. Now about Israel was a fool. Once Israel wrote up enough that he's now graduated in some college and has his own job, has his own wife and children, he cannot outgrow being a father. He is still a father to those children. He is a friend, father is still there. It's just now that he is no longer in the forefront, but now he is reaping the fruit of what he sowed to his son. Because the son is a reflection of the father. Now if you are the son without the father, you still are a reflection of the father figure that's not there. That is why it is more critical that as fathers, I'm not speaking to those fathers who are already upset. I'm not speaking of the father who's not here. To reassume their roles as fathers and not run away from what God wants them to be. He wants us to be responsible fathers. Do not run away from your responsibility as a man. 
Do not say a sovereign nation was an upper, a sovereign, so big in the sovereign. Only the ladies will go to the place team. No, they was this back on the person place team to ask the lady. How you put it in the street to the sovereign if you know a bomb? They die in that in the sovereign. As far as in the body of Christ, where you should be seen working as men, what are you doing? That is why we need to reclaim our position as men. Because right now, and it's getting worse and worse and worse and worse each and every time because we're not assuming our position. So once you get there, you forget about the ones that are following you. Unfortunately, we are continuing with procreation. We bring a form of spirits to the world. And we're not taking the responsibility of the lives yeah. of the generations we are creating. As men, see our Gulala now. It's a good thing that we're not so. It's the turnout of the women you are with or you will be with. Own the father pick and appeal to the other only and it doesn't sit down as a man to stay with her. If that father figure didn't play a very good part, you will reap. Right. If it is you had a father figure, then Kulisela are doing. But because the other part is missing the father figure, you will reap. Yeah. Now, as a man who does not put the leg away, Zamatun is a pain. That's what we should understand. But it's a problem as men. What we tend to do when we find a broken woman, we to make a in the heart. Instead of solving the situation, instead of trying to give love, we feel like the Bible has never told a woman to love a man. Never. It has told the man to love the wife. So today we mistake that and expect love in return from the woman. That's not your part as a man. And as a man, you are the one who agreed to the fall of. Old men. What for my way now? What may I allow in as a man? Not to eat. What for my way? Way in as a man. And you, you, you made the whole records of the world. What we would have been our as a man. So if there's someone to reclaim his or her position, not his or her, his position is the man. Fathers, let them be fathers because the way men, they don't address everyone the pillar as men. But, Upulawa, Adam, and Adam is the father, he was supposed to lead in the example. As a father, 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 you <laughs> Now, as a father, should be someone who should be able to protect and lead your family. I won't go deeper into the qualities of a leader. Because when you're speaking of leading, as you look at front here, you always say, No. 
the other qualities of a leader. That says, no, this one is a leader. That's why we need, poly, uh, we need leadership in politicians. Right now, they are not leaders. Let's go back in the Jerusalem. But then, leadership comes at a price. You do not just become a leader. That is why when we were to sit down and learn about leadership and then say, I want to choose a leader, no one would want to be. Because as a leader, you do not expect from those who are following you. They are doing what you've told them to do. When you are to encourage them to be something, you build in them, other than a ripping from them. That's not the case today. Most of our leaders, Bafuna Buddha, Instead of encouraging you into being someone, as you microphone, No, we are no longer needed now. You are no longer a father. Now, I don't show you, but I said, don't expose yourself. You are exposing yourself. You didn't assume the role of being a father to those kids. You didn't lead them the way you should have led them. Now someone will say, Bankman has been a good person. He has been a good person. He has been a good person. Yes, father, son, they are full of needs. Needs. Now, by nature, women are givers, and then women are, men are givers, and women are receivers. If you give the women frustration, she will multiply it. Trust me, she will. Whatever you give her, she will multiply it. You give her an offspring, she'll give you a child. You give her a house, she'll give you a family, a, a home, a place to stay. But then, seeing as men, we plant and leave. We shouldn't do that. And we do not need to a part of us. No, I want us to discard that. As men and women and everyone in the house, please. Don't please. for the wrong that you do. Don't. It's the power of free will. Look is calling people to look at the way. I don't want to go in. Over here, we are messing up things. And then come back to bed the devil. And say, Satan will not sit down at the low. Hey, Satan, Satan, this and this. I won't deny that the devil is there, but then, as far as I am cold. So, as men, I want us to forget about the devil a little bit and focus about your, about your son and say, Me, the need is of I won't do this. This is my principle. I may not wait the Lord, but we try. How to take a girl when you feel the need is so good. We should know what you have to get Satan. No, Baba, I'm not approve of that. It's something that's within you. So I'm very tired of Satan in the country. We could say, Do it again if we love it. So we could put it in the middle of it. Then you have a problem in the morning, Sunday morning. You have a choice now. You have a choice. And you can choose to succumb to that situation. And you can choose to overcome it. The more you overcome these obstacles, is the more the devil will give up on you, and then you are not his case anymore. He will see that 
This is a man of good morals. Now I went to die and I need to try some other means. I cannot go head on with him. His decision making is very strong. Now we remember that the devil was once an angel. He knows how to attack you. But then our God is strong, all right? So if you understand the power invested in you as a man, you will be able to assume your position. You will be able to know what you were as a man. And expect no one to pick you up. No one to pick you up as a man. You need to pick up yourself, dust yourself off, and make sure you do the right thing. You do the right thing. And no one will have to thank you for doing the right thing. I'm sorry to say that. No one will ever thank you as a man. I don't have a boy in the village and thank you. Ah, praise the Lord. Otherwise, it's your role to do good. It's a bad right to you. The fact that you are a man, you need to come, you need to shield your family and protect them physically and spiritually because your family is as spiritual as you are as a man. As the man. The other one who knows about the Kaya Umpana, Nana Babiana, we are Bema, Nana, we are poor. You know that? Yeah. But now I've been we are poor, the mother we are not, we are Bema. Now, so we'll put another one. Bagana, Zena, 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 they can follow and that is because there is the father of which of him uh, naturally they connect that is why in the world in our past ages people are walking up full man. the closest friend between a male and a female, a kai ubabe, is the female. I'm not sure who you know, but I'm a kai ubabe, but I'm a kukona. The loyalty to the name to what the babu guna, ba. Utata babu aku aku loyal to the name to what the babu guna, ba. You see that? Even the time we spend is more with the father. Such that mother of Mati, we are a father in Sanaba. Who would jump that to Baba Bona and Jenna Pasha, who will have been a bad name? Yes, that's my father. I'm not sure. They have a bond you cannot understand and break. What was the food is in Yella and now you talk about your first boyfriend is your father. There is a connection we cannot understand right there. But then now I know why. That's because the father has the most important role to play in the whole world. So fathers, let us assume our position. We've lost it. God help us. We've lost our position as men. It's a long an interesting lesson there for one. What can I do? I want to put this in the world. Put my hands in the world. I want to see what I want to see. I want to bless it. Now more discussions is done. Now that means shadow will be gone. Amen. Because if you've got the fathers, you've got a much cleaner nation. If men will understand who they are and assume their position. Our nation wouldn't be what it is today. The last call upon us, Jenna of us, Jenna of us, Boba, we have our food to say. And it's even harder for us to go back to Malamusha, no business food, even because we need to now tolerate and correct the mistakes of the fathers who fell out there. As a father, no staff food in the way, understand what your role is now more than correcting your own mistakes. 
But you need to now correct it with the mistakes of the other fathers. But we got there. So as fathers, we have the task to reassume our position. We need to understand who we really are. We are not just a main figure in this world. As a father, you have got more than that. So, I want the fathers to know that it's always about you and your decisions. You may want big decisions, just know that you've made that bad decision for the three generations to come. One wrong turn, you have made the wrong turn for all those who are following you as a man. You have to take the lead. You have to take the lead. So, now the best way to do that, God, men should be prayerful. You should pray as a man. Normalize prayer. Most of the men we have in our society nowadays, they do not pray, they expect the women to pray on their behalf. But we know our other better does a man who sexually enhances us. And you are a mother baby. You are crippling the family. You are a rotten root. You need to change. Now, what is the author of he knew that we can do the task of being a father. So, umasu kale utaba na gobuti we are taking a new house to take a phone and take a bag. We are going to take a phone. Now, your glory comes from the accomplishment of what you've done, right? Umfa na kula umona pumele la jenga bag. Now, that's where your glory comes. It should come from within you as a man. Do not expect to be glorified. Can I remember you not God? When you are doing what God has sent you to do, and then He's the one to be glorified, you are just a message. There are so many things around me. Why is he singing this song? I want everyone, not only the men, to do a self introspection. Am I the man that God wants me to be? And then of us in a woman. Instead of people who are with him, am I in this situation because of the father figure that was not there? If that's the case, God, please be my father from this point onwards. Lead me, guide me to greater heights. Be the father I've never had. If you have a husband, Am I the right woman for you? Am I doing the right thing to keep the roots nourished? Am I keeping my foundation in the other right? I'm happy to see the track in the other You see, the madam is a singer, singing to me, singing our one to do God help me. Help me take care of what you've given me to support. Help me be his supporter, not be his leader. You see, the boss is giving us again. In fact, the position is giving us again. You know, when I'm a fool of nine, what I'm going to say to you, I'm going to say to you. Now, you're going to go to the house. Oh, yeah. 
them inside of us and introspective. You are a result of where you come from. You are a product of that family where you come from. The law of a father. The law of your father. Thank God that you are born again. Thank God that you are now in the house of God. Now you have a father to the fatherless. Oh, it's the father who said, I'll never leave you nor forsake you. Your father and your mother may forget you, but your name is written on my palm. I cannot leave you. He declares in this word. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your word. We thank you, Father, for speaking to us in this way. Thank you, Father, for bringing us that far. We thank you, Father, for you to not look at our brokenness. You are willing and ready to build us again. We've come before you, King of glory. Teach us, Lord. Enable us, my God, to build our families, to build our communities, to build our nations. Help us, King of glory, to demonstrate your fathership in our hearts, O God. Help us to be true foundations. Enable us, Father God, to be true roots. Enable us, Father, to be pathfinders. Oh, people of God, help us to be teachers and to our generation. Father, we pray for that young man who is crying, who's been left, who has never seen the Father, who has never walked with the Father, who has never learned from the Father. Lord, mind we pray for that crying daughter. Lord, mind who has never had interaction with the Father. We don't know what the Father is in life. Oh, my Father, my God, we pray that your mercy, your grace, your peace, the anointing, Father, touch in the name of Jesus. The Son of the living God, we pray. And everyone of us say his name in the name. Amen.
Fathers are very important in your life. If you were not privileged to have a father at all, God has given you a father. My prayer is I be a father, not a pastor, not a preacher. Amen. It's my prayer that God gives me a heart to love the unlovable, to accept people the way they are and to train them help them to realize their destiny. The Bible says, see, if the foundation is being destroyed, what can the righteous do? What it means is you can be righteous, but if your foundation is destroyed, you will be cracking in the house of God. That's where leaders of the ministry, leaders of the church, we need to understand that the people that we are pastoring they are coming from different backgrounds. They are coming from places where they were never told what is right and what is wrong. They could be coming from places where there was no father at all. And in some places, the fathers were there, but they were disfigured fathers themselves. Dysfunctional fathers. Fathers that are already broken, who are coming from places where there was no father. He is himself broken. It becomes difficult for him to raise the right generation. This is why this house is very important. Because this house is built on teaching morals. Helping individuals to realize their position in life. Before we go, just a question for you. Do you want to contribute to the problem that we are seeing on the street? Are you sure you love your child to be on the street?
that when old people bring you, they call you. They are correcting the mistakes of your father outside. When someone calls you as interest, sit you down. Listen, they are building a woman that will come and build the next three generations. Have someone call you and sit you down. It's a blessing. The moment you go out of rebukes, out of correction, all the parents they say is, I'm on Donald, the Dalkuya. Hello? The Dalkuya. Ha 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 ha. Donald Jamie? Dalkuya. We have a way. We have a way. Oh, we'll get a pass of a great privilege. Listen to your parents. Respect them. Listen to that woman God has given you. She's not just a mother, she's a father to you now. Obey your parents. Obey them. It's the only and command that comes with the blessing. <laughs> and the last person to insult and to disrespect is me over your life. The moment you go out of my hands, out of my care, you are lost. If your parents have failed you, your mother has failed you, come to this house and you are prepared to listen, your life changes. Something went wrong in their upbringing. They did not desire to be there. Circumstances found them there. Those people in prison as well, if you ask them, when we were young, what did you want to become? I wanted to be a doctor. I wanted to be a pilot. None of them desired to be a prisoner. They came in a place where there was no father. The father was there in the house. Please, putting on your trousers doesn't make you a father. Bringing food on the table doesn't make you a father. It's a characteristic, the qualities that you are instilling in the children. Many of our parents are donors. They donate food. Every month they bring food, they bring food. They are simply donors. But God is looking for father. God is looking for fathers that will find their way for their children, who train them in the way that God wants them to be. Yes, your fathers fell, but God has given you a father here. Your destiny shall be brighter. Amen. You can be obedient. Your destiny shall be better. I'm not a pastor that wants to suck your money. That's what he said, if you heard it. The leadership of today is to eat from the children they are leading. No. True leadership is giving an example. Let others follow. True leadership is taking you to the fatal ground you eat and reproduce. And that can never happen until you are taught. I'm going to to an awareness. You are, you are now fighting the two of you in the house. Then you come as a big seat. Hello? As a cool of music, and I'm more. Some stand and it talks. When he has gone out of your hands, then you see what you tell us is, tell us and the team. Then pull on my own to her. 